lingered uh, into the afternoon in some places and temperatures only 8 or 9 Celsius. Now it's quite chilly early in the morning across more southern areas of the UK where we have the clearer skies, a pinch of frost. Further north there is more cloud around, but where we have those clearer skies in England and Wales there's some mist and fog, particularly towards the uh, west country and the southeast of Wales in the morning. It'll lift fairly readily, mind you, as the breeze picks up. And we get sunshine developing widely and that cloud, quite low cloud, moving northwards across Scotland and Northern Ireland and some sunshine coming in here as well. The wind's picking up in the southwest through the day. Temperatures not quite as high as they were on Thursday, not just to the east of the Pennines, but also in the northeast of Scotland. But over the weekend, we're going to find milder air gradually coming in from the south on a southerly breeze. And whilst it's dry for many, there could be a bit of rain around especially on Sunday. But we start the weekend this time with the colder air and the lower temperatures across more northern areas of the UK with the clearer skies. That's going to lead to some fog, particularly across the Vale of York and perhaps in the central belt. That could linger into the afternoon as well. Otherwise, we get some sunshine in the north away from that fog. Further south through Wales, the middle and southern England, could be quite grey and uh, cloudy through the day. A bit of rain in the far southwest later. But temperatures are beginning to recover across southern areas. Where we have the fog lingering further north, though, it will be quite chilly. Second half of the weekend, we've got lowering pressure to the southwest of the UK. Southerly breeze, these weather fronts, pretty weak, mind you, are moving their way northwards. So it looks like there's a fair bit of cloud, at least, on Sunday. There could be some patchy rain here and there, most of it, I think, running up through the Irish Sea towards Northern Ireland and later on into the southwest of Scotland. Many places are still going to be dry and those temperatures making double figures through the central belt of Scotland, and again 16 degrees towards the southeast of England. Those temperatures remain to, at those sort of levels, really, I think, through Monday and Tuesday into next week. We've got some wetter weather on Monday, but it should be dry, but still fairly cloudy, I think, on Tuesday.